Shalom Aleichem. In our days we can see that there's a great manipulation around each and every one of us that is trying to pull us away from simplicity, from simple faith in the Creator. Some of us are terrified what will be with food lacking, some of us are afraid what will take place with health, all pandemics and all the horrible rumors of more plagues and more issues to come, God forbid. People are worried what will be with religion wars, Islam, Christianity, Judaism. The world around us is consuming us through fear. Grabbing, holding our minds and not allowing us to really present who we are and really shine our own true individual light out to the world. Distracting our thoughts step by step, day by day, with every news, with every rumor that he brings up on social media in different ways. Exposing a lie, pretending to be the truth, and distracting us from focusing in the real only thing that left for us to do and is to be honest and is to express our goodness and our kindness. We need to put a fight against those dark forces that are dragging us out and away from our center, from our inner harmony and inner peace and we must shine. The only way against darkness is to shine. And the only way for us really to shine is to let the light of our souls illuminate from within by expressing our simple talents, our thoughts, our ideas, our visions, our hopes, our goals, and to be active about it in your own circles, in your own houses, neighborhoods, communities. A person has the obligation to light that match, to light that one candle. And how many billions of candles will be lit by yours is already not your responsibility. You can only do as much as you are able to do and meant to do and to let the Creator complete the illumination. In our days, we will see the complete redemption and the great salvation for all human race and the whole wide world. And definitely, we'll be exposed to the real grace and kindness of our Maker that will remove and take away all the darkness from us and will shine the light of His goodness upon us in completion. But we have the obligation to be the worthy vessels for that greatness. And the vessel for godliness is truthfulness and honesty. To be attached to the truth is to say words of truth, is to express your good attributes and to shine the light of your soul, to be honest about your journey, to share from your own life experience and wisdom, to let the world know who you are and what you're made of, who we are and what we're made of. We're roots of souls that belongs to the tribes of Israel, to the holy, gigantic soul of Abraham, Yitzchak, Yaakov, Sarah, Rivka, Rachel, and Leah. And the light will shine through us out to the world in such greatness that no one will be able to measure, even to comprehend how gigantic and how beautiful that journey was and is. So just Catch your spot, your real, true, natural place and be the one that you are. Shine your light with joy and greatness and the unconditional love of Hashem will appear. Amen.